Screening embeddings or texture inversions can be a very GPU intensive task. In this video, I am going to show you how to train a model for the faces of your choice and the process is not going to be GPU intensive as well. So let's get started. I'll be using face swap lab extension for this purpose and if you don't know how to install please refer to the video in the description. This is my third video from the series of face swap extensions and if you don't want to miss out on such videos please consider subscribing to the channel. After installing the face swap lab tool you will go to face swap lab tab and now under this tab you will go to build and now you will upload the reference images that will be used to build your model. And you will name this model on whatever you want to it doesn't matter i have trained two faces for the demonstration purposes one is of tom cruise and second one is nelson mandela now let's look at the results this process will take time depending on the gpu you have as you can see the result is decent but it can be better if you use good images good quality images with close-up faces it will give you far better results let's look at the another face i trained i will show you the images i used i only used five images for this but since the images were of good quality and good clear faces the result turned out to be good so always remember that you use close-up and clear pictures of your subject after writing a simple prompt and using few embeddings, I will show you how to use this extension now. You will see this extension below the control net tab in both IMG to IMG and text to IMG tabs. All you have to do is go to the reference checkpoint and select the model you trained. It will show in the drop down list. Select the model of your choice and don't forget to enable the extension. All you have to do is now press on the generate button and create as many images as you want with a consistent face. If this video helped you in any way, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. Thank you.